Throg here, and in this video, I am going to do a video on a binary counter in Minecraft. It is extremely compact and resource efficient, so yeah. Um, again, this is sort of like a digital circuit. It's very small, so I wouldn't count it as one, but it uses binary and all of that, so yeah. Um, just to demonstrate, if I hit this button, a one torch will turn on. It's one. Hit it again, it's two, again it's three, four, five, and so on. You get the idea. So it's really very simple. I'm going to come over here and place five sticky pistons facing up in the ground. I think that's five. All right. Place repeaters in between them. One here, lock with the button, place down your blocks on the sticky pistons, and place sand on the last four. So skip the first one. Then, for your output, you put this like so, with the blocks out, and you're going to put a torch and a repeater and a block with redstone and a torch on so that's the output right there and you do that for every single one like that and there that part's done place the torches and that is everything I know extremely quick you, you can do this in survival, so easy. Um, now, if you hit the button once, it'll set it to zero, and then you can start counting. And just if you're wondering, you can expand this to any bit size you want. I just chose four bits because it's easy and it's really quick to build. Um, yeah, this works on the principles of binary, how the one keeps starting at here, then going there, then like, so I hit the button and it starts here and then I hit it again and it goes there and then it's both of them and then it goes to the next one and that's why this works um, it doesn't actually use logic it just uses the quirks of pistons so yeah I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video